Hey guys, how's it going? Just testing out this new light that I got. I got a fluorescent light above my computer monitor now. It's right in front of me, and uh, I just wanted to test that to see if it would do better with the shadows and stuff and the lighting, and I think it does. And there was a feature on this camera that had to do with the lighting, too. I took it off, and I think it made it better. But um, I'd like to make more videos like this. You can see that background thing's pretty wrinkly now, but it's kind of cool because it adds it like texture, too, in a way, so... I don't know if it's really even a problem, maybe a better thing. don't really know what to say, but I went to the doctor today. He said that I pretty much, uh, my sore throat, he thinks it's just a cold. He didn't really see nothing wrong. He just told me to take Claritin, get a humidifier. I got a humidifier now because the air is really dry now. It's really dry here because of the heater and stuff too. <clears throat> so hopefully it will get taken care of sooner than longer. And I work today, and so I might still have another week worth of work or so, which is really good, actually. It's going to help me out a lot. Uh, but then, I don't know if it's going to go on much longer than next week. That might be it. But it could go on longer, I don't know, however long they need me, I guess. But I figured I'll share this book with you. I got another book today. I keep getting books. But these are some books that I really wanted all year. This That Norman Geisler Systematic Theology, I made a video on that. I just got this today. This is Tori's new topical textbook. It's another big book, about 600 pages or so, I think. And uh, it's just a really good topical, you know, a really good resource um, for verses, uh, just to find all kinds of things in the Bible. Um, this has some more things to do with doctrines and things. So I also got this. First I got this, and this isn't really what I wanted, but I'm glad that I got it anyways. But this is Navi's Topical Bible. That's one of the popular ones. This doesn't have so much of the doctrines and stuff. Uh, it does, but it's... I don't know. I can't explain it. It's... Let's see. It says this is a comprehensive digest of over 20,000 topics and subtopics with more than 100,000 associated scripture references. And this has a lot um, where stuff's mentioned in the Bible. Just It talks about like duty. It talks about duty of man to God, duty of man to man. And it gives all these verses that talk about those things. Um, so this is really extensive. But I do like this one a little better in some ways, the Tory's new topical textbook. You can find both of these online for free. They're on a lot of websites, um, and so I'm using them for my studies because they're, they're like public domain. They're really good. Of course, you know, they're not perfect, but I don't know. This has more like the doctrines of Christ and stuff. It goes into a little more detail than I don't think that Navi's has that stuff. I can't even really explain it really or give a good example, but... I don't know. This has more like the attributes of God, too. Different attributes, and it goes into details, and Navi's doesn't really have that. But these are, uh, you know, there's not even really a reason to buy them. I mean, because they're free online and stuff, but I still like having things in paper. And, you know, before the internet and stuff, these were definitely helpful things. But, I mean, I'd still suggest them if somebody's interested in this. But I thought sometimes maybe I'll just do some videos and I'll just flip through these books and I'll just be like, let's just go through these scriptures and just see, you know, what these verses say and stuff. See if I can learn anything just right from these books. And then go right to the Bible. But, anyways, I thought I'd share that. I still have some more books coming. Nothing, I don't know if it's, uh, I have one coming on like numerology numbers in the Bible which is just an interesting study it's not really you know something necessarily that the Bible particularly teaches but kind of like a subjective thing I guess uh, but it's going to be interesting and I have something else too I don't remember what it was but anyways 
I had quite a quite a book, quite a bit of books on my wish list, but I've already have so many books that I need to read, and a lot of the books on my wish list I'm finding out like the futurism is false and stuff, and I had books had, that had to deal with that and stuff, and I'm kind of like I don't even really want those anymore. You know, they're not even going to be good. So, but I'm getting to the point to where I've gotten a lot of the books that I really wanted, and I have you know some of the best books I think that you could find to really do studies. So I would suggest these. But uh, still, probably won't be doing too much until it works completely finished and my sore throat's gone and everything. So hopefully, next week might be my last week. If it goes on longer, then that's good. But I'll just get to whatever I can whenever I can. But just testing out this video, this new light. I think it looks good. I'm pretty pleased with this. So I'll probably make some more videos like this with this background and everything. So just random video again. So. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it, and God bless.